idiot. I put a pen in here, I swear. Where's... Come on. to make reservations tonight. The concierge said the crabs are supposed to be really good. We'll probably have enough left over for a nice dinner. Ian? Ian! Some oxygen for the rest of us, boy. <laughs> Happens all the time. What does? What was that? Happens all the time. Uh, hello? Yeah, uh, I'm on an elevator with Elvis. Are you joking? But, j just listen, please, okay? Well, we're stuck on an elevator. Well, how do you know it's stuck? Because we're not moving. I don't appreciate being around. Call Hello? 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 Thank you. Thank you, Three Star Motel. Okay, listen. I'm gonna hoist you up, and then you climb out the top, and you can tell us how far we fell. You lost me. <clears throat> Kids. Come on. You're acting like an elephant in a jar. I need to get out of here. Don't put it there. This place is dirty. Look, just, just lift me up. How many times I gotta tell you, boy? It ain't gonna work. <clears throat> Damn it. Easy, boy. Tell you what, this ain't no castle for the king. I sure do miss the rolling hills of Mississippi. The moonshine, skinny dipping at midnight. Oh yeah. Right. From what parts do you originate from, boy? New Jersey. A native. What brings you to Atlantic City? Uh, just visiting. Nice tux. <laughs> Thank you. Where'd you get it? You ask a lot of questions. Only asking cause clients often do. Clients? Grooms to be. I'm off to officiate a wedding right now, in fact. If we ever get out of here. Care for a cigar? No. You'll be fine as long as your tuck stays smooth for your pretty bride. Don't put it there. 
Jim Morrison once got a squeaky leaky on the same floor. I don't care about your friend Jim Morrison, okay? I, I gotta get out of this elevator, this hotel, this, this, this stupid state. I don't think you understand the erotic intricacies of a squeaky leaky and what it could mean for your impending marriage. Stop saying that. Squeaky leaky? Marriage, I'm not getting married. You're not getting married? No. Why not? I don't know. Is she promiscuous? No. Is she a Democrat? Yeah. Oh, is she dumb? No, she's actually valedictorian. She mean? She's very kind. Uh, the other day, my underwear tore and she sewed it back together. Okay, boy, tug it back. She's perfect, isn't she? I don't know what's wrong with me. You don't have to be no wise man to see that love has smacked you in the face. And boy, you are smacked. You're head over heels, stupid in love. But that ain't your problem. It's not. It's your saving grace. What does she want to do? Oh, she wants to be a neurologist. Well, that's what she wants to do right now. That's what she thinks is best. Uh, she, she got enrolled into a five-year undergrad program, which should automatically enroll her in a grad school program in New Jersey. She what do you want to do in life? You don't know yourself any better than I do. Listen, you can run away as much as you like, but you aren't going to solve anything until you figure out who you are. Should I marry Amy? That's up to you. Are you ever married? To a boy named Sue. Oh. You don't listen to a lot of music, do you? Uh, John Mayer. Um, thank you. Tim. Ian. 